today we are at the Villages and behind us is Walmart and we're not doing a tour of Walmart. No. No, everybody knows what Walmart looks like. However, the one at the Villages is a very large Walmart so I might just show you a little bit of the inside. But we are here today to see if we can finally find a pumpkin before Halloween. I'm hoping they have them. I hope they're cheaper. Yeah, we tried at the pumpkin patch video. Yeah, but so anything under like $15, it's gonna be great. And then also- We might just end up with like a wooden pumpkin <laughs> thing or like a styrofoam pumpkin. Maybe, hey, if it comes down to it. And then we're also going to buy some ingredients for something that we're gonna cook for Halloween, which will be a future video. But while we're in there showing off some stuff, comment below on what you think we'll be cooking should be fun as fun as Walmart can be let's go check it out so you can see the Walmart starts all the way over there and goes all the way down there so it is like I said a very very large Walmart they do have a really good garden section over here I'm gonna go ahead and get us a cart here And then it shows Walmart here stays open until 11 o'clock. You can kind of see, like I said, I'm not gonna show much of the Walmart, but how long of a store it is all the way over there, this particular location. Look at that, NFL. We didn't see pumpkins on this side, so we're gonna head down to this other side, but look how far it goes and see if we can see just a thing of pumpkin. Surely to goodness, there's like one pumpkin somewhere. I am very good at picking bad Walmart carts. You can see these tires and you can see how it gradually just keeps going to the right. Look at that. Yeah. This one <laughs> does need an alignment. This one's rough. No pumpkins on this end. So starting to question if, if we're even going to get stuff out. So we might try the outdoor section just to see. And then I might ask and if that's a no, then we're not getting pumpkins. You can see they already have it doesn't feel very pumpkin-y. No, they've already got a bunch of Christmas stuff out. While we are over here, here's the outdoor section. Filled with some Christmas trees. Did one quick look outside. It smells like pumpkins. It does, yeah, it does. Okay, well, the only other option is to ask somebody and then... Yes, get creative, but we still came for other things, so it won't be a wasted trip. And here are like all the aisles of Christmas, so more Christmas, Christmas, the Grinch, Christmas, <laughs> good grief, and that's where it ends. Now, obviously, in an ideal world, you wouldn't wait a couple days before Halloween to look for a pumpkin. But also in an ideal world, you wouldn't really want to pay $20 for a pumpkin. So if we don't get one, kind of our fault since it's close to Halloween. But what did you just find? That's cool. Oh, lantern. It's a blow mold. That's nice. I like that. This is kind of some still Halloween fall things. And I don't know. Might have to just say we'll do that. Hey, there's a gold one down there. Definitely not giving up yet. We're going to still look over by the grocery section to make sure we didn't miss it. But then after that, plan B. Typically, they're probably right up here. Um, let's see. Potential? Those? I don't know what those are. <laughs> that might be our only choice. <laughs> At this point, anything will work. What's in this? Why, why don't we carve, we carve watermelon. You wanna do that? No. That might be our only hope. Huh, well, let me look this way. Now in the back of the store and I'm not seeing any pumpkins. I did just look on the app and I saw it was out of stock, so. Looks like we are gonna have to be creative here. All right, our three options are grab one of those pumpkins that weren't really like pumpkins, grab a watermelon and carve that, or what was your idea? I just said we have to make our own pumpkins. 
Um, It'll be a part two of this video in 2023. <laughs> I think we're just going to be creative. I'm not sure what that looks like, but let's just walk around and see what we can do. And carve, we'll carve something. Might carve a donut. I don't know. It I don't know what to do. like carving. It might just be like decorating. Decorating something. All right. Game on. Here we go. So with this option, you could possibly just cut the top off, try to scoop everything out, which you still get food. And then... That would be so, like, messy. <laughs> Or you just cut it in half, clean it out, and then just use each half for something. You could set it back. Mm -hmm. That's one option. I don't know. These guys are still available, which I mean, <laughs> I, would, I wouldn't call that a pumpkin. <laughs> so you could, yeah, you could do an alien on there. So there's that option, and then just kind of randomly walk through the store and see if we find. I yeah. Them, like, but not to, for what we're looking for. What do you think? This is like. I'm just walking around. Just this is like a TV show where you have to try to like craft something with nothing. Also, this is the third cart I have got, and finally, it's actually smooth and works. I mean, I might know what I'm doing. You do? I might know. Hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't. I need crafting. I need to go to the crafting. We're gonna section. head to the crafting section. So you have an idea, and you say go to the crafts. So we're in the crafts. <laughs> Down this aisle. Oh. Oh my, burn my fingers. <laughs> Is that right? Thir Fourteen dollars. Oof. Can I just do a small one then? I will say that's cheaper than the fifteen dollar pumpkin. So. <laughs> but that's not all I need. That's true. You did find something cheaper. <laughs> you found a cube. Is that what you're going with? Yep. Okay. Hmm. okay. I'll just I'll just tell you. I'm gonna like initially I was just gonna use a circle and then take flowers and stick it in all around oh. it, like orange flowers. Yeah. You could do that. I'm for sure doing a watermelon because that's the closest carving I can do. So gonna do a watermelon. <laughs> what are they? Oh, that's awesome. I've never heard this in Walmart before. Great ride, though. One of my favorite rides at Magic Kingdom. Mm -hmm. Speaking of cooking, they've got pretty good deals on these KitchenAid mixers. Quite a few of them in stock, too. So for five sixty-eight, I can get a two-for-one. You get an actual thing you can carve and actual food. So I just have to find the best one because it's gonna be weird to, that maybe that one, good. yeah, that one's good. Maybe that one over there. Let me go over there and look. You might have to carve it like this. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, so it'll sit. Our first thing we are buying is pumpkin pie spice. So that's what we're looking for right now. We realize we do have some things at home. So once we start our other video, we can show you all the other ingredients, but where is, no. Oh, what a wonderful time. No pumpkins, pumpkin pie. There's nothing down there. So, hmm. One perk to being tall is, check this out. I found pumpkin pie spice right up here. And it's probably the last one in the entire Walmart. So thank you, Lord, for helping me find that and helping me be tall because I was able to get it. So we're back on track to the normal ingredients. You got the pumpkin? Just the regular plain, that's what it calls for. Nice. Another ingredient, light brown sugar. <laughs> Look what you just found. It's new. Wow. Have you ever had cinnamon toast? Imagine using this in addition to your butter and that, your sugar. Yeah, that's a game changer. 364 over there. Next items, cream cheese, two cream cheese, original. Next, eggs. We like these organic happy eggs. Free they range. had ones that we got last time that were like the Easter eggers, so they were like blue and... Yeah, they were fine. They were happy. They're good eggs. Yes. This is not an ingredient, but I love eggnog, so definitely got to get some. It's that time of year almost. Last thing we needed from here, cupcake liners. Now we're heading to checkout. 
All right, we're back outside now. Whew, survived. All right, that was our trip out to Walmart, a place that we don't really care to go to. And it was an epic fail. Not no pumpkin. Really. Well, no pumpkins. It was a pumpkin, no pumpkin fail. Fail on that part. Yes, but we're going to be creative. A win for creativity. Yeah. And we really didn't get to show you, I mean, we showed you the items we needed for what we're getting ready to make. So good luck on trying to guess what that is. Mm -hmm. But stay tuned for a video coming out. I think that's it. I'll give you a hint. It's spooky. <laughs> yeah, good one. That's a good hint. With that being said, that does it for today. Thanks for watching.